All right, hi Sarah, hey Pam. Hi. Hi Irene. So today we're here getting ready for the Hey Frage live show. I'm gonna scoot over here. Oh, we get to now you get to see Pam behind the scenes, everything that goes Killing into the it. transformation in action today. In action, full Facebook live. You can trust Pam to make you look good because she looks so good. That's so true. I feel like you never want to have like a beat hairstylist, makeup artist working on you. Oh, that's so nice. So you're killing it. Well, Sarah's an easy, easy client. Am I? Oh, oh, here, do you want to wear my sweater? I need to put this little blanket on. All right. I'm ready. Now I just need a little warm up. Ooh, look at those brownies, girl. This is what I look, no makeup. And then in a few minutes, we're going to be, boom, transformed. Pam works quick, I hear. She works super quick. She's done a ton of Sarah's looks, and she always looks beautiful. We've always done Sarah's looks for the podcast. Always. Yeah, dude. Now she's just throwing on some base. I don't know. We just wanted to let you guys in on the little, on the little getting ready party before the show, because we always enjoy it. So Sarah's eyebrows have been transformed since <laughs> we've started working together. Do you hear that they've been transformed? They have been been they're really bad. They were pretty bad. When they we were first pretty started. bad when we first met. I mean, they were like in every direction. <laughs> North, it's true. South, east, and look at him now. He's always like pluck. Or trim. Oh, yeah. Anything. Never. It was like Hushman. <laughs> but it's now been... they're flawless, just like Sarah. Yes, queen. Uh, I only like trim them. That's the only thing they get really long. They get super long. It's like. Dude, at least you have eyebrows. My eyebrows are platinum blonde for an unknown reason. It's true. Oh, well, that's good. At least I have them. You always want more brows than less brows. Yeah. Ooh, we've got 11 people watching. Hey, 11 people. You're Leave a, a comment. You're makeup tutorial by Pam. Yes. Oh, yeah, dude. This is priceless. You're going to learn a bunch and of shit. Here. Leave that's a comment stinky. asking some makeup questions, and maybe Pam will answer them. Also, oh, hair. She's like a master stylist and color expert. Yeah. Oops, sorry about that. Have, if you guys have questions with what I'm doing, I'll try my best to answer so backstory, I've known Sarah for like <laughs> six years. Yeah, Pam. What? Mm -hmm. Six years, you know? How'd y'all meet? In a nightclub. Yeah. No way. Yeah, through our friend Glenda. This is a true story. Shout out to Glenda. Glenda introduced us. We were there for what? Was it a charity event? It was some sort of like charity event for Leukemia Lymphoma Society, I believe. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't yeah. remember if Glenda was going for like Woman of the Year or something, but then we... You were hosting, and she wanted me to get introduced to you. Oh, and Kritma you says, hey, Pammy, Sarah, I know hey. you know this, but you're always in the best hands with her. Good luck on your show. I just did her hair yesterday. Oh, yeah, <laughs> queen. How's your hair look, Pritma? Pritma? Is that how you say it, Pritma? Pritma. Mickey. Pritma. Mickey, Mickey. Mickey. Mickey? Mickey. I think that's the cutest name for a girl ever. Oh, Ooh, look at those brows, girl. Oh my god, your brows look so good. <laughs> okay, I thought you were getting ready to zoom out. No. You were like, oh my god. I have, I have a thing with brows because since I don't have them, I love them so much. Well, I always tell Pam. Ooh, Marcy says, yay, see you tonight. Oh, yes, that's our live ticket winner. Or the Waxing the City winner. Hey, queen. I always say that Pam... The issue is, Pam does my makeup so well. Now I refuse to see anyone else. And when, even when it's like free, people are like, hey, I'll do your makeup for free. And I Sarah oftentimes. Sarah gets set up. <laughs> no I'm response. sorry to say, I'm sorry to say, she's been set up before and I haven't been happy. I'm like, what is happening? Like, what's up? Because, Pam, yeah, what is it? Some people people always want to tint my face or something, right? They want to darken the... I feel like they make you like a newscaster every time. Yeah. I'm like, I get that she works for Fox, but she doesn't look like she's doing that type of work when she's doing her Fox Live. I mean, her podcast. That's very fair. Yeah, I always feel like... I call it the Who is that the tart look? look? Like I always look like a I'm selling homes and like a realtor. Yes. It's that kind of makeup. This is already looking so good. And this is just like base and shadow. So I always have this. Like 
this philosophy with eyeshadow that like less is more. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because I find that it just doesn't take that much shadowing in order for the eyes to come out. Unless you're going for something very specific, like you're trying to match a certain color to your look. And you should never do that, but... Um. I was just going to say, are you a believer in like wearing the same no. color eyeshadow as your dress? No, no. But like, oh, don't already, match. No, don't match. No, but like seriously, with Sarah's look, everything is very soft and sultry, and then we choose features like her eyebrows or her lashes or her skin to really make her stand out and everything just takes a back seat because she already has beautiful eyes we don't want to overdo them very true so what's the palette that you're using our favorite Too Faced Tarte Tarte oh well. Too Faced has had <laughs> some drama lately Tarte Okay, Tarte. Close. Both start to the T. You'd like Tarte, uh, Sarah, because they're all very, like, Amazonian clay source, natural. Right, yeah, all organic. Ooh. Shout out to Tarte. This has been my go-to palette for everything I've done for the past two years. <laughs> Not spons, but should spons. I just love it. But isn't there, okay, I think, I feel like I was looking with you. You have this. It's Tarte in Bloom, right? Yeah. That's that palette. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You're such a good blender. The key to blending is building up that color, so. Not just going in with a ton and trying to blend it out? Yes, or I've seen people try to like compartmentalize and put brown here, light here, and it's all like in there. Oh, earth. really? You know, this is something that I always have done, building up the color. And then I have Sarah open and I take a look to see if I need more. What do you guys think? More? Less? Pam's the expert, but... <laughs> <laughs> she just wants to know. I just want to know what you think. Like. <laughs> Live show prep! I know. Well, it's also super relaxing, so I can fall asleep. But... <laughs> Alright, Pam. Have you ever fallen asleep? When? When we're doing makeup? Yeah. No, but it's Never. sometimes like really relaxing. It is, it's like little pops. Yeah. So Pam, who are some of your favorite like YouTubers um, when it comes to makeup that you like to watch? Oh, thank you, Megan. She says, looking good, love y'all, good luck tonight. Thanks, Megan. Thanks, Megan. Megan Eisenberg. Um, it's been a long time since I've watched a YouTube toot. But if I had to shout out like my fave, I definitely love Desi Perkins. Oh, she's Ooh, awesome. Girl. Desi Perkins, I don't think I've watched anything. She's like this gorgeous, what is she like half? She's Latina, I think mean, she's Mexican. Yeah, she's okay. stunning. Beautiful girl. Okay. I just like that, you know, her, she goes for different things. But yeah. always a natural look. I think the natural look is so key. Don't it's you? So it's so key. It's key for events, I think. Yeah. It's not so shocking, and that's really important when you're getting dressed up in all black, having something more sultry, is not to overload again with color. Yeah, oh, yeah. I agree. I feel like it's too many times my makeup is like I'm a different color face than I am my neck, which is really odd. And then the eyes are always like super smoky or something. It's yeah. Your green eyes pop with this color. Good. I mean, the eyeshadow part is really done. Honestly, we're just gonna tight line underneath the lash line. Okay. Sarah, look down. Look down. Mm -hmm. Now, some people would freak out about this. But that doesn't work. But it really makes your eyelashes look super thick and cool. Ooh. I'm gonna go with the gel liner because I feel like okay. it's gonna show up a little bit darker. Hold down for me and turn that way. What do you think about lash extensions, Pam? Um, I've never done them before, but I think if you go to the right person, yeah. they, you know, they can end up looking great. 
but I would always consult before you decide. Where is that? Okay. Always do a good Instagram check. Check. Lurk. An Instagram check. check. Okay. Here's my question though with eyelash extensions. Mm -hmm. But they only last for like two weeks, right? Yeah, and you can't like use makeup remover what? and I stuff. I thought it was six to eight. Oh, maybe it is. Oh, maybe I, you're right. I, I don't think know. it might be closer to two. Um, but you're also the makeup artist, so there's a very good chance we're wrong. Eight weeks. You can't get it wet the first day or so. Oh, okay. Um, I feel like I wanted no to try mascara. That. Oh, really? Them. Yeah. You have That's to crazy comb them me. out, I believe, once in a while, just so they don't get tangled. God, that's a lot of maintenance. It's really for people who want that look every day. Because the idea is once you get eyelash extensions, you don't have to do put makeup on, right? No. Like it just, it's like it's your eyes pop vacation. so much. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, okay, maybe I need that for my next vacation to make. But for Cuba. <laughs> for Cuba. Oh, <gasps> I waited to get that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Live, live show. Who wants to sponsor wants Sarah getting? Sponsor Sarah. <laughs> Which Lash Studios want to get a fat sponsorship? That'd be amazing. Yeah. With Sarah Fraser. I actually want to try them. And we're going we're gonna to go together. Okay. Oh, yeah. Go. So it's a two for one sponsoring Sarah and Pam. You want me to close or look down? Uh, look down. I'm measuring. This is my favorite part, by the way, when we get the... Um, oh, the lashes or yeah. everything? I love that. I'm just right now measuring. Why is that important? And then just so it doesn't look like it's too long. Too long fake lashes are the worst to me. And I see women wear them all the time, and I'm like, ugh. And do you, you mean long by length of the lash, or like the width of the band? The length. Oh, interesting. I always have to cut them for that. Oh. Yeah, anyways. Okay. And it's always, people ask me this all the time, do you have to put mascara? Right oh, before. Yeah. So you should put mascara right before. Yeah. Okay. Because what ends up happening is that you're doing all this eyeshadow work, and then all the powder falls onto the lashes. Okay. So you're gonna have this veil of like lashes, your own lashes that have all this makeup in it and then lash on top of it. It's oh. not gonna look as dark. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, okay. So you always And look at Pam's lashes, she would know, girl. I know, Pam, your lashes are amazing. Always, always down Are those the ones you're wearing? Yeah. Those are so, I feel like every time I go to Target and like almost buy them, I'm like, oh, they don't look great. But then they look Yours so looks, good on you. I know, hers look like, they look like real on Pam. Yeah. Maybe it's really I think they, My God, my best friend Anna always makes fun of me because I think they look so natural. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I always wear them like they're natural, but when I put them on other people, so. <laughs> really? shut up. Yeah, it doesn't look. Doesn't look great. Don't you feel like makeup is so customized to the person? I yeah. Just, that's why it works for people that you've known for a while because you can then play around with their looks. Yeah. You so know? it is. I feel like you do have to find that. Makeup artist that yeah. Makeup true. is an amazing thing. It's an art. It's an art that makes people feel good. Mm -hmm. I'm all about that. I'm ready for a cocktail or something to make me feel good. I'm exhausted. <laughs> it's been a rough week. Who else has had a rough week of you guys that's watching? I swear, is this week some sort of Mercury, like... In retrograde? Yeah, what's going on? There's this amazing website that's just called Mercury is is Mercury in retrograde dot com and the <laughs> when it comes up it just says yes or no. What does that mean? Yeah, what does it mean when something's when, in Mercury? When Mercury's in retrograde it means that like I'm pretty sure it's like um the sun is not in the place it's supposed to be. Okay. But it happens like a lot, and then so when the sun isn't right, like people aren't right. I don't know. Oh, so that's people <laughs> aren't right. Oh my god, we believe that. We believe. I was telling Pam about all the topics for tonight's show, and she was getting very excited and thought they were funny. Oh, because good. I've been living under a rock, obviously. <laughs> I don't know. Anything. You've been busy, girl. Oh, Bree McGowan says, Me, I've struggled to wake up every morning and feel so exhausted for no real reason. I hope the show tonight makes a better end to a rough week. Good luck. Aw, thank you, Bree. Oh, sweet. It will. We're going to Sweet baby it. angel. Bree, look at so much lashes. Energy. Killing it, killing it, killing it. Oh, and then Pam curls them. I always curl them. It's 
one of my tricks for lash out. Does that not rip the glue off? Because you're not curling it at where the, the glue sits. You're curling it right before that. Really close to where the band sits. So it just merges the two the two together. I feel like every guy watching this is probably like, Ugh. if there are guys watching this. That looks so flipping look good, good, dude. Guys. How do they look? Fire. I haven't even seen the, I'm, I don't get to see the end result till the end. Oh, that's way more fun. Anything. No, I don't even know. Oh, you're going to love it. Yeah, I don't want to see the reveal till the end. So the look we're going for is like very sultry. It looks like it's gorgeous. Mm, okay. Is there anything you struggled with, Pam, when you were getting into makeup, like putting on lashes or doing winged liner? Like, was there anything like that? I was self-taught makeup artist, so I didn't have any formal. That's amazing training, that you were self-taught. You know? That's awesome, dude. So I think I struggled with everything at first, and then we started to kind of get training. I used to refer Mac for a really long time. Oh, really? She's yeah. a Mac girl for a long girl. many years. Cool. So Did you like doing that? Yeah, I loved it. I felt like it was my training ground. That's awesome. It really opened up my eyes to all sorts of different artists. And celebrities. Pam's very modest, but <laughs> believe me. Um, let's see, when you've done Anna Wintour's makeup, that's pretty <gasps> much like when you know you're the top. What? <laughs> that's insane. I, like I, would, I mean, I would only go to Anna Wintour's <laughs> makeup. Obviously, okay. obviously. There's a lot I made. Mean. <laughs> 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 it's like oh Piss. Yes. Oh my god, Jonathan yes. just said Mercury in retrograde and what it means for you and then he sent us a whole article about it. So we'll read that later because we're Facebook live. Pam is very modest, but I swear, I always say this, like when the YouTube show is live every day, Pam is doing my hair and makeup to get me ready all the time because she is the best. Steven Tyler, you name it. She's worked with everybody. <laughs> Oh, do you like the real technique sponge better or the beauty bun this beauty blender? I actually really like this because of the flat surface. Ooh, very cool. It really lays that foundation down. A lot of people think that the beauty blender is a lot better and I think it's pretty comparable. It's got its place. It's got, you know. But that one's like five bucks and the beauty blender's like twenty bucks. I think. I I'm really bad in the shop, I don't work. <laughs> <laughs> I need this one. I don't have this one. Oh, <laughs> when Sarah and I were playing around with her makeup, I was putting, I was using a beauty blender on her, but it was like a, like not the brand. It was a knockoff. It was a knockoff. Was and it then like tough as nails. It, well, it was tough really as nails because she had never wet it before, and oh, that's how she was putting it on. Pam, I didn't realize that you had to wet these sponge things. Oh my god, you guys, I can be slow at moments. I had no idea. You're supposed to. Be it was like more than one. Well, the reason why you wet it is because it absorbs the product and then it adds moisture into the foundation. Oh, and it makes okay. it more like skin like. Oh, I love I mean, once you start applying with the sponge, you love it. Or the or never go back. blender. Sorry. Never go back. This is not a sponge. <laughs> Just your everyday kitchen sponge. <laughs> yeah. Dude, you Wait, look so good. Of, who thought to put makeup on with a sponge? That's brilliant. Because it makes a huge difference. Look at those eyes. How's this 28 year old skin looking? Killing yeah, it. That's amazing, Jen, you guys. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> oh, Rachel Regis Mal Malika? Malika? Just said, I didn't know that either, lol. Thank well, you. Well, girl, now you gotta whiten, you gotta dampen your sponges. Everything that I learned makeup wise is from Pam. I got you, Pam. Pam, Pam. Pam, Pam. Pam, Pam. That can be what all your followers are called, Pam. Pam, Pam. Pam, Pam. That could be someone's name. Do you know what I mean? Pam, Pam. Pam, yes. that's so P Pam, P H A M. Yes. So, I'm a big highlight contour. Okay. Oh, really? Do you like cream contours or. and highlights? I highlight only highlight creams. Interesting. Why? Because I like this. Hmm. And I think it just is, it's more forgiving on the skin. When you start to layer a bunch of different powders, 
making it making very fast on top of the foundation. Okay. So with Sarah, everything is soft. It's really pretty dry skin. <laughs> I do have really she dry does. skin. You know, what do I need? I need some different moisturizing products. What do you like for moisturizer? What do you think I should do? Do you drink enough water? Probably not. I'm very basic with my skin to my finger. I use that I feel to wash my face. I use a Sunday Riley retinol drop for nighttime. Okay. And then I use a Bosha. Well, and your skin is I phenomenal. Know. I so. know. <laughs> Panther. Oh my. Oh my. I use a Bosha makeup oil remover. Makeup oil remover from a Bosha. It's oh, like I need that. See, makeup I, to break up, I believe, is it? I think my skin's so dry because I almost have to wear makeup every day, and then I think I take it off with just your basic makeup wipe, and I wonder if that just strips the skin. It's not really cleansing the skin. It's just removing what's on top of the skin. So what you want to do is really break your makeup down, and then remove it. To make a point, whatever is left over that you weren't able to get. Okay. Uh, okay, so I need to do a two for. I'll tell you later. <laughs> yes. Shout out to Seth. Seth. Yeah. You know, the next time I'm, he's down, you have to meet him. We need to introduce. Who does? Who do you know that's single? I need to hook my brother up. Like with a really good woman. I know a lot of single girls. You do? Oh my god. Some of them work here. Cool. Alright, Seth, hop on this video. <laughs> <laughs> so, hit us with those thumbs up, though. Yeah. <laughs> he did? No, I'm oh, just hoping okay. he does. <laughs> okay, what are you doing now? Contouring your nose. Contouring my nose. Okay, what product? What is this? No idea. It's a creamy. <laughs> <laughs> It's no a clue. cream pal that I've had for a long time. I think it's Graftobian. Yes. Graftobian HD Super Palette. Okay. Um, so skinny. Ooh, Jennifer Hubble says, that's a good look for Sarah Fraser. Paola says, good look at, looking good, girl. Thanks. I don't know if she said it like that. I added that. <laughs> There's no right and wrong way. Really? No. To do what? To highlight and contour, you just have to have the right colors. Oh, see, that's awesome. I feel like a lot of people are very intimidated by highlighting and contouring. Yeah, I am. Like, on my own, I'm not sure I know how to do that. I usually start off with the forehead, right? Okay. Keep your beauty blender in hand because you're always going to use that to soften whatever contour you created. To kind of buff it out? Yeah. Okay. So, you want to lay down the line, the contour line, with a very fluffy brush. Okay. Like a duo fiber. Okay, Irene. Sorry, girl. Sorry, girl. Sorry, girl. Yeah. Irene loves Irene makeup. Well versed. Oh, Rachel says, I look like a clown when I try to contour. I know. So right you now, like... The, but, like, yeah, look how yeah. seamless that is. It's because you're doing little bits of it. Like, and then the beauty blender, whatever sponge you have next to you, use that to kind of blend out the perimeter and diffuse it. See, it's like... Yeah, dude, that looks really insane. Soft. Okay. Like, insanely good. This one? Paola, can't wait for tonight. It'll be a lot of fun. Yes, it will, Queen. Paola, bring that, those gorgeous purses that you have. She's amazing purse collection. Oh, really? Yes. She's just like Jimmy Choo, hot pink little purse that I want. Bring I'm that like, so Sarah can steal that. it. Yeah, Sarah will steal. Mm -hmm. Rachel's like, that's awesome. I look like a clown. No, you don't, Queen. Just blend your life away. I'm telling you, having a beauty blender on the other hand while you're applying your contour really, really makes a difference. This ring light is also killing it. I know, that ring light is great. Is that yours, Pam, or is that here? It's a salon. Is it just for makeup light, or is it hair selfie? It's actually, we use it for hair photos. Oh. Diva ring light. But it is a great makeup light if you have poor lighting. My hair is cute. 
lighting is key, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Maybe I need one of those for my apartment. Are those expensive? Somebody um, Amazon now. I think <laughs> I think this one was three hundred. So not bad. Okay, that's not too terrible. Yes. <laughs> I mean, it's a lot for a life, but you know, but it, you know, it's helpful. Oh my god, I wish I could get to the point that I could do my makeup like okay. this. Okay, um, hey there Sarah, do you know if the poster's already paid for? Or is she using the card you gave her? Um, I don't know, have her text Paul. Ask Paul, because Sarah's Paul, not sure. Because I thought Paul was a friend of Paul's, so... To help, yeah, tell her to call Paul. Can you call Paul? Call Paul. Um, we'll probably be here for another, like, 20 minutes. Okay, very chill. Bye. Sorry, okay, fam. Trying to charge her. I don't know. She like just it. asked. It made oh, she made it seem like she hadn't asked so. yet. I think it's. I so think I was like, he said was comped, but she can just call him. Okay. What's this? Now? Is it still contouring? This is blush. This is blush. That's a gorgeous color. On Sarah, it's my absolute favorite. It's raisin blush. Raisin blush oh. by Mac. It's by Mac. Mac. Will do, but my husband. It's like my go-to blush for every single person's skin tone. It's a universal color. Raisin. It's called Raisin? Yeah, I gotta get Raisin you Mac. You guys gotta grab Raisin. It is really, truly a beautiful color for daytime, nighttime, everyday time. Okay, and can you send us your skin products? Because I need your skin. Yes. Mm. Paola says, will do, heart face. But hubby said nothing will be better than that Jimmy Choo. <laughs> like I was with you at the comment, then I didn't understand. Oh it, yeah, so I don't understand like, oh. either. But we're here. <laughs> we're here with you, girl. We're here. Yeah. We are with you. We just lost you at the end. Okay, I really want to look, but I'm not going to. Dude, you look. I'll tell you right now, you look great. <laughs> she says, "Irene is the sweetest." <laughs> I mean, this is. Irene is the sweetest. Irene, are you excited to interview Dustin Diamond? I literally week? am creaming over. I'm oh, so stoked. Um, Kind of. No. Yes. Um, no, Saved by the Bell. Saved by the Bell, yes. Oh, uh, Jennifer says, Irene, please tell Sarah she's way too hard on herself in her email to me. Oh. And she asked who's doing the makeup. Pam. Pam. Pam, how do you pronounce her last name? I don't want to mess it up. Jacino. 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 Pam Jacino. Pam Jacino. You can find her on Instagram at hair by Pam Jacino. That's D. Pamela. 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 Pamela Sorry, Jacino. Queen. <laughs> I'm You'll find post, someone else. I'm going to post about Pam later tonight anyway, so you okay. can go to my Insta and then follow her there. So make sure you follow that. I'm actually going to end this because your phone battery is dying. Oh, it is? Yes. No, we can't. No, keep it going till it dies so we can get the end. The end. Will it publish going. though? Yeah, I think it should. I mean, how much did the 10% pop up? Uh, the, the low power did and then I hit low power mode. You think it'll be fine? Yes. Okay, cool. We're going to push this damn battery. You better stay with us. Ooh, that me. highlight. That highlight. It's popping. Girl! <laughs> what's this? What's this? Oh, we need to show this. Oh, is that the bomb? This is like the bomb, Mary mm -hmm. Luminizer. This is an old, faithful, always works. Always using it on Sarah. Okay. Uh, look at Sarah right now. You guys are so high. Fuck. Uh, what do you think? Brilliant. Dude, you look beautiful. Thanks. Love I'm that. telling you, Pam does. She makes me a new woman. Yeah, this oh. also, let's be real, has taken 15 minutes. <laughs> I know. That's the thing. I'm telling you, we'll be done and like we'll be out of here in 20. Like Pam this is can like do lash it. Lash application, everything. Which that's what kills me. It's like I go to these other makeup artists and it's Pam's like, like what other makeup artists? Minutes, not by choice. I usually get looped into something where they're like, hey, we're you're at this charity event. What Thank you, you Grace. Makeup? Grace says absolutely gorgeous in all caps. And then I tell people, no, I don't really need my makeup done, and they're like. That you really should, and then I hate it. Oh, what's your most it. loved color in that palette? Which one have you finished? I mean, everything that's <laughs> dirty pot, everything. I, I mean, look how like amazing. Oh my gosh, I and that's that is, is really that the only one. thing you used on the eyes? The only thing, the only Stunning. thing I used on Sarah. That's actually, I need to like wipe this out and write Sarah's palette. <laughs> <laughs> They're the only person that uses this palette. Oh, works well for me. Oh, it's so pretty. She looks gorgeous. We're gonna do. A I wonder if anyone has an iPhone charger. It's a hair I salon. I'm do, sure people have iPhone charger. Do a front. We have a charging station, but it's connected oh. to yeah, the front. Oh, oh. Yes. 
Oh, now it's 10%. <gasps> oh, no. Should be fine. Oh, you think so? It'll hang yeah. on? Okay. Hang Stay on. tuned, guys. See if it hangs on or not. Hang on. Okay, and now we're adding... We're just setting the under eye. Is that all you set, or do you set the whole face, too? Just the under eye. Ooh, why? Sarah's got dry skin. Dry skin. <gasps> Interesting. Yeah. You don't need to set. See, that's the other mistake makeup artists would make with me too. It's like so much powder and it just doesn't look, the setting makes it look so dry and wrinkly. Yeah. I look like an alligator. <laughs> Shoot me and make me into a purse or a bell. Something. Or a Jimmy Choo bag. Alligator boots. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we can always, okay, well, we'll keep going till our, till our battery dies. Oh, maybe. look at her. I feel like your mom. Like, and you're going to prom, yeah. <laughs> prom, like at prom. Prom was the only time I've gotten my makeup professionally done. Really? really? Mm -hmm. Well, I feel like I didn't I didn't get mine professionally done until I was I probably either. in, like, maybe even out of college. I only did it because the woman who I used to babysit for was a makeup artist, and she's like, I'll do it. I was like, all right. Oh, really? Your yeah. boss, your ex-boss was a makeup artist? Yeah. She was awesome. I wonder where she worked for. Well, she's over in California. She was self-taught and, like, um, did her own stuff, too. It wasn't, like, yeah. a company, but she was just, like, freelancey. Yeah. Self-taught makeup artist. Hell yeah, you are. What kind of mascara is that? This is False Slash Waterproof by MAC. Love it. I always do waterproof on Sarah. Yeah, I, I tend to always need waterproof. And always. it doesn't drip, you know, doesn't... Mm -hmm. Down. Gab, she's going to wear a black dress. <laughs> yeah, what is everyone wearing tonight? I want to know. Well, the improv's like a fun comedy club, so like most people just wear jeans, cute mm. top. I don't know why I get like all. Because it's your show, out. Queen. Your, the sh That's why. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you look so cute. Does she not look absolutely gorgeous? Yeah, dude, you're killing it. Okay, I'm excited. So you're making me have to like very much up my game. <laughs> Oh, your makeup game? Now. Fatality. Okay, what's this? I'm just setting the uh, contour with the bronzer. Oh, very setting cool. Setting the contour with the bronzer, okay. Just to bring everything together, tie everything in together. That's always key. Finishing touches. Okay. Bronzer. Just a very casual All right, so I think 15 gonna, minute full glam. 15 minute full glam. I feel like we should end it here and then post the photos. Oh yeah, I love it, yes. love it. All right. All right, well, thank you so much, Pam. You absolutely killed yeah. the game uh, once again. So Sarah, you look gorgeous, and we will see all of you little sweet baby angels tonight. Bye. Bye.